Traders Anthony here looking at the euro dollar. This will be a quick video. I've got this four hour time frame and I wanted to point out when we have a strong trend like this, I'm always looking for the pullback down into a previous balance area. What I mean by that is, for example, well, have a look here. We've got this red candle prior to this move. If we pull that across, see how we get the retrace back down in? Have a look at this one back here, red candle, pull it across. Okay, so we're looking for, you know, the rally and then the retrace back into this this area. And if we do the same thing, we've got this uh, move here. Well, we've got this candle here from this high down to the low. Okay, it rallies, so we get the pullback. There's our buy. Same thing again. So if we repeat this process, this one here may or may not have, uh, yeah, okay, so this one wicked down. We may have just got a touch. And what I'll generally do is layer in ending orders down through this zone, this range here. This one, you know, the the, the, uh, the first pending order would have been uh, filled and the others not. And that's uh, part of uh, what happens. So we've got this area down here. Pull it through. Okay, so we missed out on this pullback. But you can see how this strategy can be fairly consistent. And uh, I mean, this is what I'm using to build uh, a few different accounts that I'm trading at the moment. So with this in mind, if we have a look at this setup here, I'm interested in in uh, going long but i don't want to get involved up here uh, so i'm going to be looking for a retrace back down now if it does trade down into this level well and good you know i'm uh, i'm in and uh, there's an opportunity now if it happens to uh, give us a shallow pullback and trade without me let it go because there's going to be so many opportunities so this is my euro dollar uh, setup for today i'll be looking for the, the retrace back to, actually if we grab the Fibonacci pull a fib from low to high here and go with a, a fib pullback see the 618 to 786 okay well that's generally the area generally the area okay in this case we had this very thin candle here um, quite a strong rally up so you know but if we pull the fib uh, with with these uh, opportunities further back we'll find that this 618786 is usually a pretty good uh, a pretty good zone to get involved with a trend continuation as we can see with the 4h so guys that's my uh, setup for today click the uh, link below actually uh, uh, I'm, I'm sending out free trade signals every day uh, by email and uh, you're welcome to uh, join that so with that I hope you have a great day safe trading and we'll see you in the next one